Well, during the symposium, we talked about the HERT time study, a prospectively randomized study for patients with HERT new positive metastatic breast cancer with prior treatment with trastuzumab, pertuzumab, and TDM1. Patients were randomized between tucatinib, a, a novel tyrosine kinase inhibitor, in combination with trastuzumab and capecitabine versus trastuzumab and capecitabine alone. And that study showed a significant uh, benefit in progression-free survival and also over-survival, favoring the combination with uh, tucatinib. Um, this was true both for hormone receptor positive and hormone receptor negative patients. So in, in my view, uh, and this is how we, we state that in our term guidelines, the combination with tucatinib is the treatment of choice after pretreatment with uh, dual block hydrosuzumab, pertuzumab, and also TDM1. Now, as you already mentioned, um, we saw the data from Destiny Breast uh, 03 study at ASMO 2021, and that probably generated a new standard of care um, showing TDXD is much better, more effective than TDM1. Does that uh, conflict the, the hurt to climb data? I don't think so. It just defines a new second line standard. And I think the, the combination with tucatinib um, is probably standard of care in patients after ADC treatment, probably now in future TDXD.